I think it was not a very smart way to sit down. But I know a very smart way to pass biochemistry. This video has been motivated to be created for Sai Prashant, which is a subscriber, which he texted me. We had a very nice chat and I asked him which year he is in and he told me his first year. I asked him which subjects he's learning with. He told me physiology, pathology, biochemistry. And then I was like, wait a minute. Biochemistry, I personally feel, for, well, firstly, I aced the course up in school. Some other colleagues also did that. However, I still remember so much of what I learned because I understood it. I did not memorize it. And secondly, I had such so much of an easier time, you know, like test questions that were so simple. Well, not, that, not that simple, but they made sense. And I just had to think critically and I didn't have just to be like, oh, trying to remember the answer. So this was possible, not because I'm smarter than my colleagues, of course, not far from it, but this was for one reason. And the reason of this is because of the resources I use. So there's four resources I'm going to be talking about. Let's start with this. So research number one. So this bad boy, it's called the rapid review of biochemistry. And basically, as you can see, it is ultra thin. Everything which is in here, it's this is like a guide, you know? So once you study, you come to this and everything which you need to know, it's going to be in here. And if there's something you do not know, and it isn't here, you better go back to the other resources. So this is absolutely high yield. I'm going to link this book, like the online version of this book, PDF, high quality for free down below on the description. Now, if you go from not knowing nothing of biochemistry to grabbing this book and trying to learn biochemistry, you're not going to get it because this book, it's not an explanation. This book, it's more of like a list of the concepts you need to know. In this book, however, it's going to teach you the basic core concepts. I know this book looks bigger and thicker, but don't worry about it because this book has like 20 or 30 chapters and only four of them are of biochemistry. By the way, quick message is that out of the four uh, researches I'm going to be talking about, three of them are for free. Well, two of them, but one of them I'm going to gift it to you. And the fourth one, it's not for free. However, I might give you a solution. This book, it's absolutely fantastic. Four of these chapters you need, which is the one of lipids, carbohydrates, proteins, and nucleic acids, which that's biochemistry. Basically, this book honestly gives you with beautiful colors, with beautiful images, it gives you like the core concept, you know? So this is going to go like, after you go to lecture, you go to this book or before lecture even, and you're really going to get it. But between this book and this book, you cannot do the jump, you need a bridge. And what's going to be your bridge? Your bridge is going to be YouTube. Which specifically channels you may ask? That's a third resource. And that's going to be Ninja Nerds. So Ninja Nerds, or Ninja Nerd, it's such a fantastic channel. Like I cannot put enough emphasis on it. I'm going to link the biochemistry playlist of them in the uh, description, absolutely free and absolutely fantastic. Go subscribe to them, like them. They are honestly fantastic. And the fourth one, which is, let's say, you already went with this book and then you already went to Ninja Nerd, you watched the lecture, you got it very well, and now you go to this book and you're like, uh-huh, uh-huh, I get everything, mm-hmm. Oh, I do not get this. What's the solution? The solutions go to this fourth research. And this fourth research, it's called Ameva Sisters. Ameva Sisters, just like Ninja Nerds, but it is not so much for learning. I mean, you can use it to learn, but it is better. I recommend you to use it better for reviewing. So you already used the MCAT book, you already went to Ninja Nerd, and now you are using this guide to see if there's anything missing. Indeed, there's something missing, no worries. Go to Miva Sisters, they have a video, they're all pretty short, and you're going to manage it. So with these four resources, which are extra resources, you're going to be absolutely ace in the course. However, now this was the video of the resources and I have a word to share with you guys, especially to Sai Prashant. So, hey guys, look, doesn't matter how well you understand this, you honestly always have to pay attention to the presentation of your professor. Let's say they have PowerPoint presentations and that's how they explain it. 
the questions unfortunately are not going to come necessarily from here they're going to come out of their presentation so you always have to put that as your main resource however secondary resource put this ones on and yeah biochemistry it's a beautiful subject it's a bit hard at the beginning because you're getting used to medical school but you're going to get the hang of it i trust you i believe you guys and please any questions you have about this anything you're like a bit confused about or how to optimize each book or anything like that please let me know down below and i'll definitely make a video about that so that's about it if you like this video please consider subscribing liking and comment whatever you you want to comment if you found something helpful comment it if you did not comment it and tell me why so i can improve so thank you for coming i hope you got some value out of this video and till next time